You know, the few men that are getting married today, a lot of them want prenuptial agreements and they, because they want to protect their finances. Well, you got this one woman and some women like that, that she didn't want to sign the prenup. Let's go ahead and review it. My last relationship, we broke up because he asked me to marry him, but then he asked me to sign a prenuptial agreement. And I said, absolutely not. I think that's bogus. I'm not going to sign a piece of paper that says that if you leave me, I get nothing. Like, no, I think that I should have half of everything that you've worked your entire life for. And I think that's fair. <laughs> Hence to why you have a prenuptial agreement and you did that man a big favor by, by leaving him alone. You know what I'm saying? If you guys were are willing to take that risk today in a Western world, you better do a prenuptial agreement. You sure you better. And if she don't like it and say, I'm not signing that, I'm going to leave. Okay, do you. But I'm not, I'm not doing it. I am not going to have somebody take a half of everything I work for just because you want to leave. See, see, if, if the marriage was like, hey, if you just want to leave because you want to and you can't take half your stuff, hey, it don't matter. It is what it is. But just because you want to leave, you can take half? No. Men have to protect themselves. Because these women it has all the stroke in the family law courts. So you better protect yourself. You better. Don't be the dummy that's going to lose everything. See, that dude was smart. And that dude going to have money. And he going to keep money. Because he know how to dodge women like that. But let me know what y'all think about, you know, this situation. Or fellas, have you, you know, approached a woman and say, hey, when you sign this prenup uh, and she left, let me know.